Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are diving into a major shift in Ubuntu's release cycle, the introduction of monthly snapshot releases. Canonical wants faster feedback on in-development features, and these snapshots aim to provide that. Traditionally, Ubuntu has adhered to a six-month cadence. Stable releases arrive every April and October. That means users saw Ubuntu 24.10 in October 2024 and Ubuntu 25.04 in April 2025. Between those dates, there were no public releases. Now, Canonical is filling that gap with snapshots, monthly builds that let testers try out the latest changes before the next point release. You might wonder if this turns Ubuntu into a rolling release distribution. It doesn't. Snapshots are strictly for testing. They're not meant for daily use. Instead of waiting months to see new features or bug fixes, developers and enthusiasts can install a snapshot in a virtual machine or on spare hardware that helps identify problems earlier and keeps the stable releases more polished. In other words, Canonical is supercharging its release schedule without abandoning the familiar April and October rhythm. Snapshots won't affect version numbers. For example, May 2025's snapshot is called Ubuntu 25.10 Snapshot 1, not Ubuntu 25.8. I do. Let's look at the snapshot timeline for Ubuntu 25.10, nicknamed Questing Quaka. May 29th, 2025. 25.10 snapshot 1 June 10 2025 25.10 snapshot 2 July 15 2025 25.10 snapshot 3 August 19 2025 25.10 snapshot 4 September 18 2025 25.10 beta October 9 2025 25.10 final release if you visit the Questing Quokka snapshot of one page on Ubuntu's website, you can download the ISO for testing. Uh, remember, these snapshots are unstable. Only use them if you're comfortable reporting bugs or testing new features. To check your current version, open a terminal and type LSB release dash A that displays your Ubuntu release information. If you install a snapshot, you'll see 25.10 snapshot 1 before it's officially released later in October. If you rely on Kubuntu or other Ubuntu derivatives, don't expect snapshot releases right away. This process is a canonical initiative for the main Ubuntu distribution. Flavors like Kubuntu will stick to the regular point release model, at least for now. Here's when you should consider a snapshot. You're a developer or tester. You want to try the latest GNOME updates, kernel changes, or installer improvements. You have spare hardware or a virtual machine. Never install a snapshot on your primary workstation. You're willing to report bugs. Snapshots help Canonical fix issues before the beta and final release. If none of those apply, stick to Ubuntu 25.04 or wait for the October release. That covers the essentials of Ubuntu's new snapshot releases. Monthly builds won't replace stable versions, but they'll speed up testing and give you an early look at upcoming features. If you decide to try a snapshot, remember to back up your data and keep it on secondary hardware. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more Linux news and tutorials. Leave a comment if you plan to try an Ubuntu snapshot or if you have questions about the process. See you in the next video.